what will be the output of this program. In the main function, a variable i is declared and is initialized to the value 2. In the next step, it is incremented and is stored in the variable i itself. So here it is post increment. A post increment is an operation where the variable will be incremented after the expression is evaluated. So that means once this step is executed, the operation increment will be performed. So next, a printf statement is given where an expression i++ plus i++ is printed. Now let us check the output of this program. If we compile this program, we will get zero errors and when we run the program, the result is 7. So let us check how we got the output as 7. Initially, the value of i is 2 and in the next step, we are increment the value of i. So, after evaluating this expression, the i value will become 3. In the printf statement, the argument given is percentage d i plus 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 i plus plus. Now, let us take this separately and evaluate. So, i plus 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 i plus plus. According to the precedence of operators in C language, the increment operators will be executed first before the addition operator. So now, the value of i is 3. First, this post increment operator will be executed. Since during a post incrementation, the incrementation will be performed only after execution, here the value of i will still remain as 3. And when the next step is evaluated, that is i++ is evaluated, now the value of i would have changed to 4. So here the value of i is 4 and now the added result will give us 7. Only after printing the value of 7, now this incrementation would have been evaluated and so the i value would have become 5. But this is not seen in the output. So that is why we have got the value of this expression as 7 in the output screen.